Have you ever heard of hammerhead worms? If not, you won't soon forget them. They're an invasive species that can regenerate if you cut them in half. Five News reporter Ian Taylor spoke to a local woman who says she found the strange worm in her yard after all the rain we received last month. It's not science fiction, but the predatory hammerhead worm looks like it's straight out of a movie. I did not exactly know what it was. Uh, I had never seen anything like this before, so what I noticed was that it had a, a shape like a hammerhead. These worms originally came from Asia before making their way into the states through importing potted plants or soil. And these slug-like creatures feed on earthworms, which can have a negative effect on our ecosystem. It's, it's one of those things that, that is a, a menace. It's uh, things that we're not adapted to. Um, it can, it can harm ecosystems by uh, destroying the uh, earthworms in it. He says take precautions when handling a hammerhead. Its toxic slime can cause a rash or discomfort to pets. The toxin is not in the concentration where most people will have to, to worry about them, but we recommend wearing gloves if you have to handle these things. So how do we get rid of them? The broad answer is we don't. There isn't a pesticide that can eliminate them, but you can use some household items to do the trick. In my experience, salt, pouring salt on them is the best way to uh, kill them. And I have not tried putting them in the freezer or anything like that. I just have poured salt and that seems to have worked on killing them. Experts warn, don't cut up hammerhead worms to dispose of them. Each segment can regenerate and you'll end up with more worms causing problems. In Fort Smith, covering news where you live, Ian Taylor, 5 News. Wow. Well, for more information on hammerhead worms and how to get rid of them at home, you can go to 5newsonline.com. We have more on this story on our website. Moving on to the